Back in elementary school, I was diagnosed with a speech impediment. Uh, I came and told my mom what they said at school. Uh, she didn't believe it, but she went to investigate it. I was uh, sent to a speech class uh, uh, because they said I had problems with my clusters, consonant clusters, my shuds and my chuds. And the amazing thing is, is, my wife, my mother came up to school and investigated and she uh, acquiesced and let me go to classes. The classes that I had to go to took me from my schoolwork, uh, my regular classes, so it was a disadvantage to pull me away. Well, time has gone by and you judge whether, you know, I've never been pulled onto the carpet for my shuds or my chuds, but I went to school in an inner city school in an impoverished zip code, so you can be diagnosed with just about anything. But, hey, my mom told me, Steve, we'll beat this. She told me that. And with the help of the Lord, I think that we did. So every now and then, you need somebody else outside of you to tell you that you're greater than your diagnosis. Your diagnosis can't keep you in the box forever. Your diagnosis doesn't tell that everything or your worth or your wherewithal, whatever your diagnosis may be, you're greater than that. Have a good one.